Okay, so this is a quick video to show how to switch between Zen 401 and Zen 402. Right now, the absolute path is set to Zen 402. So if I just turn this on and we go and look, it is connected. Now, some individuals are having trouble switching from 1 to 2, so I wanted to show and some, some others are having uh, difficulty with redirects. So this version that I'm showing, the redirects were brought forward and then there were some options added in for the, the WP uh, site URL. So let's first change over to Zen 401. And the first thing you need to do is shut off Zen 402. Make sure these are both off. Go over to the absolute path. If the absolute path is incorrect, then you will get all kinds of errors. Widgets will not show up, etc. Once we have that in, we can then click on Zen 401 and we will immediately get redirected to Zen 401. This is why the absolute path has to be correct. Otherwise, you won't log in to the WP admin. All right. Once we're done in, now we have a bunch of options that have to be uh, have to be saved. So we go into the back panel and we have to start saving things. So this is saved and this is saved. That's correct. Redirects. If you want to change it to the uh, to not use WP guess URL and instead use the git site URL, then you'd change this option. The users are not being mapped at this point. So we need to turn that on. Now mapping, only, we only care about secondaries. We only care about this right here. All right, anything coming from Zenforo, not this information. So we come down here to administrator, contributor, editor. If we had put in author, we could have done that also. All right, this maps these secondaries in Zenforo to a role within WordPress. Turn it on. Save. Next thing is down here in the toolbar, you may have to save save these settings. So if you want to set set conversations or something like that, maybe you want that on in the toolbar. Make sure you go through every option. And then now we are in Zen 401 and you'll see that we turned on this option here. Log out, make sure it works, log in, etc. If you don't see the toolbars, go in and change things. Now let's go to, let's say you're on one and you want to go to two. All right, let's go in. With same process, we're in one, we want to get to two, so we have to shut that off. Then we do the absolute path. Once we have the absolute path, we must be correct on our path. We then go in, set to two, and we're going to get redirected. Well, if you're not redirected, then that means that your, your absolute path is incorrect. Now notice, notice the widgets aren't here, etc. You're logged in. You just need to go to the WP admin. Go here. Click on the user mapping first. Again, we only care about the secondaries. And on. We also want to make sure we get some of the others. Go just go through, make sure toolbars and things like that. Make sure everything's saved. We should then be able to see the widgets. Here they are. And when we go out, we should be able to see things. But notice the toolbar is not there. Okay. If we Go back, log in, there are the toolbars. 
This is just because the options were not being saved. All right. So there you go, going from one to two, two to one, and then showing the redirects that should happen. I hope this helps.